Hey everyone, it's me, Arthur Cade. So Mark Waters, you couldn't find a more fun project to direct? Was yeah. it like Bad Santa? Sequel, I'm in, right? Yeah, totally, <laughs> you know. I mean, I, I've made all kinds of like really nice family films my, in my life, you know, like Freaky Friday and Mr. Popper's Penguins and spider Chronicles. When it gave, came an opportunity of saying, Billy Bob saying, hey, I want you to do the dirtiest movie of your career where you can do every raunchy joke you ever had in your head but weren't allowed to say aloud, like I jumped at it because, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of like, you know, a dream come true, frankly, where I didn't have to have any filter for once. What's everybody getting with Bad Santa too? You know, I think you're getting like, you know, it, it's, it's what the country needs right now, I'm going to say. It's like we need to have like cathartic, subversive laughter that's going to kind of like cure all of our anxieties. And, uh, and, and I think the great thing about the movie is that it kind of like also is a little bit emotional at the same time, but never sentimental. You end up feeling something by the end. It ends up kind of working like a Christmas movie, even though, even though it's not a Christmas movie. The first one was such a cult classic. Is there pressure when you're directing a sequel to a cult classic like, that you have to get this thing right? You know, I didn't think about it because it would have been kind of too constricting, but I didn't know that, okay, you know what, I want to service the, the love of the first movie while make something that's kind of bigger and better and funnier at the same time. So there's certain scenes in the movie like where the, we, we call it the caramel pizza scene, which when you see it, you'll know what I mean, which is a, definitely an homage to the first movie. And it's kind of a wink of like, yeah, we're aware that you're fans of the first movie and we're going to acknowledge that. But we also know by the end of the movie, it's going to feel like, wow, this is a much bigger event.